this is Becky with iHeart Art Studios and today I'm going to show you how to do the perfect ombre sunset which can be a great base coat for several different types of paintings. I'm going to do this painting in real time so here is the video without further ado. Enjoy! For this painting I'm using acrylic paint red orange and yellow and a one inch flat brush. I start with the color red and I'm keeping the brush the flat way or the wide way keeping the bristles together, moving back and forth. You may need to do smaller brush strokes to fill in the texture of the canvas. And then I like to do long, smooth brush strokes from one side of the canvas to the other to smooth it out because every brush stroke will show. Make sure to grab enough paint so you're covering the canvas. Now I have a lot of practice doing this and give yourself grace and I do apologize because I know I make this look really easy. Now instead of cleaning my brush, I just wipe it off on the canvas there. Now I grab some yellow paint and I start down in the white area and there is still a little bit of red on my brush and that's okay. There might be a little orange tint to it, no problem at all. If you have too much orange, just wipe it off on a paper towel. So I'm going to start moving that yellow up towards the red, leaving a little gap between the two colors. If you're more experienced, you can use the red and yellow, but if you're a beginner, it's helpful to use a little bit of orange just to connect those two colors. This will create that beautiful ombre look. I'm just gonna blend these colors together so it looks smooth. And I do this by sweeping my brush back and forth on the canvas, going up the canvas and down the canvas. And you can do this as many times as you would like. Now when I'm first applying the paint, I like to use smaller brush strokes. So down here near the bottom, I'm gonna just grab some yellow to keep it a little bit brighter. And see the brush strokes are a little bit smaller because I'm filling in the texture of the canvas. If you move too fast, you're gonna see too much white space under that. So I do smaller brush strokes, and then when it's covered, then I do the long ones, smoothing it out all the way across. Adding a little bit more color there, keeping it nice and bright. And I had a little something on the canvas. I'm just going to use my finger to remove it. And now I'm going to blend it all together. So I'm going to sweep my brush across the canvas, left to right, right to left, all the way up, and then take it all the way back down. This will bring some of those lighter colors up and some of those darker colors down, giving it the perfect ombre look. Let me know if you try this out. Thank you so much for watching.